And uh, school systems are crazy right now, gang. If you're in school, you got my sympathies because it's wacko in Canada, United States, anyway. Um, if you're out of school, um, really be considerate to those who are in school. Uh, there's a lot of kids that are struggling with what's going on, right? Uh, especially extroverts, especially those that need the uh, attention for them uh, to work things out, to get over some of the hiccups that they may be having, learning any subject, especially mathematics and physics, uh, sort of things that if you're missing one little piece it's very hard to grasp things that are being built on that concept, right? So be considerate to those who are in school who might be struggling, who who need help, um, who might be feeling angry or depressed or sad uh, because a certain part of their lives, and for some people, you know, going to school is very important to them. And youth in general is very important, the social awareness of it, right? Um, there's a little trauma there, right? I was talking to a friend yesterday and uh, she mentioned uh, in she knows people in different parts of the world where they've been in lockdown for a long time, okay? And uh, she mentioned specifically she knew people in Spain that have been in lockdown for a long time and uh, for a few months and she mentioned one of their one of their friends they have really young kids and those young kids have been in an apartment right for a few months now right and when the first the lockdown opened up a little bit and they were able to go to the park because that during a severe lockdown in spain i believe only one family member was allowed to go shopping and come out so they were living in the apartment and when the young kids went out to the park, they were having a hard time adjusting to the perspective because when they're living in the apartment, their eyesight is usually you're seeing within a room, right? So they weren't used to the vastness of nature. So he said, uh, she mentioned that the kids were really overwhelmed by the nature and the trees and the light and stuff like this, which is something that I hadn't considered before, right? So there's a lot of things happening to our society that we're not aware right now. Okay. Tuchin Jason, my younger brother has just started his college studies over the last few months and he has been absolutely taking the whole thing in stride. Super proud of him. Awesome, Tuchin Jason. You should be. You should be. Right. And kudos to him. Right. Deckman, I put off my last year of college because of all this did a half semester online and it was miserable i'm studying film which is so hands-on so online classes absolutely don't cut it props to your younger brother for sticking with it yeah props to jason's younger brother and the a deck man you're not the only one uh, there there's students that i know that have dropped out of certain classes that they're taking now they're taking correspondence trying to deal with that uh, and a lot of classes they've been gutted right not that they were they weren't gutted before but they're gutted even more now like there's a couple of chapters that they're not teaching like i have one student uh, in math 11 and one of the chapters that they took out was personal finance so they're not teaching personal finance like <laughs> what it's crazy 